for the time being, since nobody has bought the metal halide yet, and I was given a Kenya tree and some Zoas by a friend for free, um, the light that I had on this appeared to be inefficient for the Zoas and the Kenya tree to open up. So I hung the metal halide. It's a 250 watt, so I hung it really high. And I'm going to see if tomorrow how this all looks. The boards were uneven, so I put this under here to keep it level. And I got the light right underneath it. And we'll see. You can see the Kenya tree right here. The Zoas are right on this rock. Hopefully tomorrow we'll be able to actually see them. All right, so there we go. It's currently Thursday night. So almost the end of, I believe, week four. I'll know for sure when I go to post the video. Uh, just refer to the title for the timing. And as I've been doing, just a quick update on the kids' tank. Their mangroves are growing nicely, some new roots coming out, and the leaves are nice and open and showing some new height. And this actually has come out more, and the leaves are much greener than they were. And it was attached to this hose by a rubber band, and there's actually an indentation. The rubber band was loose when I first got it, so the indentation shows that it has actually gained some girth. So, we'll be monitoring and seeing what kind of growth we get. Obviously, the fresh water is growing faster. Um, but the salt water is growing too, so that's awesome. Uh, not as many brine shrimp in there now. I think a lot of them, I've noticed, they actually cling to some of the algae that's in the bowl and are feeding off of it. So, if I see anything significant worth uh, filming tomorrow I will for the end of week update.